Right, good morning everybody. Welcome back hey. to another Isolation Days. <laughs> so I saw you Monday. It is currently Sunday. So I took a week off. I've just been a bit rough. You know how I felt. I don't want to go on about it. But thankfully my ulcers are gone. Yeah. My ulcers stayed till Thursday. Like I literally, it, just to eat was just really painful. And yeah, it was just a horrible horrible experience but i'm feeling so much better um yeah we've just this weather is incredible we've got another week of really good weather the kids are officially on easter half term now so this week anyway i found that i've relaxed a lot more with homeschooling i mean we're obviously still doing bits and bobs but i just relaxed a lot more i've enjoyed this week more than the first week and i think it's because i've just the first week I was in shock, I think, of just having to stay in. And what's wrong? What? And this week I just feel like I've just started enjoying it and just taking it day by day and actually just lapping up, being with the kids and just not thinking, oh my God, this could go on forever. Like, I'm just, yeah, I've just relaxed and just think, actually, it's quite nice it's being at home. And I'm not going to lie, we do have a really nice place where we live you know it's we've got places where we can walk around the farm and you know what i mean um and the kids they actually really don't mind it at all they don't have any problem with being at home they love their own surroundings and they entertain themselves quite easily and it's helped get miles in quite a good routine as well what's wrong who's that he's a baby yeah, you just want all the attention. <laughs> You're such a little cheeky one, aren't you? Yeah, you are. <laughs> but anyway, I hope you're well. I hope you're all healthy and safe and, you know, just enjoying the quality family time because that's pretty much what we have to do right now. Oh, well, Miles has just woken up from his 30 minute nap. 30 minute, not long enough. He basically woke up in a big grump. Haven't you, really? Which is not good, although he looks happy now. Hey. <laughs> Hello. Right, while the children are with Miles, I am just about to strip our bed. I like to get these sheets clean on the weekend and I did the kids yesterday. And while it's a nice weather, I can stick the sheets out on the line, which is glorious. <laughs> Gym, so I'm going to do half an hour in here since I might as well get it done. It's only, that's not the right time. It must be five past nine. I haven't changed that time yet. You were passing by, surrounded by all those butterflies. Suddenly they flew right in my heart. Must have looked like a living piece of from the moment I knew, I knew that it would be you. Yeah, from that moment I knew, I knew it could only One thing I love about Easter is the Easter decor. I just got the box out. I like Christmas this, and Easter and Halloween. Um, I think Easter is my favourite though because I love hares, rabbits, like my favourite. So, I like yeah, I'm excited to see. My what favorite. we've got, yay! Put all the Easter decor out, are you excited? I am. <laughs> I haven't small. literally bought anything because I know, look, I've got pretty much everything, look. including crafts. Let's hold them up then, let's have a look. They are so cute. Wow. They go on the fireplace, don't they? Lucky Girl has got two pretty this one's my favorite. headbands. Miles' first Easter. Miles! 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 
is that like, what have you done to me mother <laughs> okay so let's go through it we have got plates napkins cupcake set we've got plenty of time to make cupcakes I've, i swear i've had this set for like two years so we are going to use this look how cute that set is we need to use that don't we bye we've got loads of crafts a ridiculous amount of crafts in here again why i don't bother ever buying anymore because we always have an overflow look at these oh, yes those little um egg lights we've got somewhere to put those Got loads of random stuff. I'm trying to let go of this heartache. It's been following me around. It wakes me up. Right, I think that's as good as it's gonna get. So I always have my Easter bunting up. You can see it says happy Easter. That is from a from Mary Mary, but I got it from Home Sense. But Mary Mary obviously is like the brand and they always bring stuff out every year. But um, I've had it for God knows how many years now. Um, there's two strands. And then I've got my little rabbits here also from Home Sense. I've put my little bunny over here as well, my little hair. Um, with the eucalyptus. So that is pretty much the fireplace. And then on, the, on this little, I put the eggs here. Um, my little marble rabbit has been out for a couple of weeks now because I just love it. Um, again, that's from Home Sense. This is from Tiger. I got that a few weeks ago. And then I put one of these little eggs in the fake plant. And then over in this area, I've obviously always got these frames up but I changed my little pumpkin thing my little grey pumpkin I changed that for the rabbit I'm not sure where that's from it's really old um, and then these are actually from I'm sure they're from the pound store originally but they're just little coloured blocks that says Easter um, I brought out this little I don't know what it is little robin maybe with a little crown and then I put two more of those twigs in that's all I've got I can't find any more in my faux plant um yeah so that's kind of that little area and there's miles in my belly look at that that was june last year and then i swapped over my reef as you can see i've got my easter reef on now violet is making up the little playmobil rabbit set and we usually kind of we usually put this over here on the floor we could always put it on the table over here or something but yeah, that is pretty much Easter decor. I don't have a lot, but it's it's plenty because otherwise it just gets a bit too much, doesn't it? It's, it's like hoarding everything, I find. I think the most things we've got actually is crafts. Like this is a whole bag of like crafty stuff. And one thing I would like to do if I find a couple of really nice twigs is do a little Easter tree, Easter egg tree. So we've got loads of these little eggs. Right, miles down, second nap. He was up for about two and a half hours. He just, yeah, he just he was fighting it. He was fighting it. He was really tired. I'm just gonna put the washing out. Glory! Look at that. You know when it's getting close to summer when you get your crocs back out. Look at these, my garden crocs. I'm trying to let go of this heartache. It's been following me around. duvet cover oh my god i thought it was gonna go on the floor right sitting down i haven't sat down all morning you know you just realize i haven't just chilled i've been dotting about doing this that and the other i'm actually gonna see if i can watch half an episode maybe of dare me before the kids come in it's definitely not for children but it's really really good and i've got myself a little coffee and tahini brownie snack so we started watching this last night, Gordon, Gino and Fred. It's so hilarious. You need to watch it. Again, it's not for children. We watched this um, Friday night. 
and then we plan on watching the new Jumanji tonight. We watched this yesterday. <laughs> the Nest. We started. Me and Graham start watching that. It's really, really good. We've we're two episodes in. Um, yeah. Right, I'm just outside. One thing I did get to do yesterday was tackle my tyres. Tackle my tyres. I'm not going to touch them and actually fill them up yet because. Um, there's just no point, it's just still a bit too cold. But I de-weeded everything. This is my lavender hydrangea. They always come back. Strawberries have just gone everywhere. But I'll probably put a couple things, obviously I top everything up. I usually top my rose bush up with new soil. Put some stuff in these ones. And then I want to fill these two. The strawberries are here. We didn't get any strawberries out of them last year because they were too new so hopefully this year might have some I usually have my baskets done but clearly um, hasn't happened so I'm taking my three baskets down Graham's put the Manitou back so we put all the old stuff in there and he actually managed to get a delivery of just some hanging basket plants these are kind of the more hardy stuff um, Ivy, I'm not sure what that is. I'm sure it says it on the pot. I can't remember what that is. Anyway, yeah, so I'm gonna fill my three baskets that go around the front of the house. And um, yeah, start getting a little bit of a spring. This, these are my autumn baskets, dead. California weather, it's like 90 degrees It's making me hot and he has the same effect on me It's just something about the way that he's making me feel My insides are out, I just wanna shout his name oh, My body's giving up on me Cause I don't know what to do with my fingertips oh, I wanna run up through his hair But I'm trying not to stare mm -mm. I get a little starstruck when I see Graham's come in and is making his famous sausage rolls. What flavour have we got? Pork and honey. What, both pork and honey? Both. That's pork and honey. Yeah, um, Lamb and minted pea. <laughs> is that what it is? <laughs> I can see the peas sticking out. One of each than the other. They look. Oh, really? Yum. Right, Miles is still napping. He's been asleep for two hours. So, I'm, yeah, I mean, it's only half past 12, so I'm not too concerned about him oversleeping at this time. But, yeah, that is pretty much our lunch. Right, we are heading out for our daily walk. It's hot. You getting on your bike? Getting Goldie. Miles had lunch, we had a little bit of playtime. There's Goldie. Be gentle. Well, Alistair's already riding his bike. As you can hear, Graham's mowing the lawn. Oh my god, it's so warm. By me. When that wind isn't around, it's so nice. Um, yeah, we're just going to check out the pigs, get some fresh air. It's about two o'clock, I think. Time's flying by today. There's Alistair doing what he does the best. Are you coming to see you, Miles? Look. Hello, Piggy. Hello. How are you doing? Mm. <laughs> Hello. Getting braver now, aren't you? You're getting bigger. Nice scratch. I think she loves me. We're just always here, so I think she just, yeah, she loves my smell. 
Hello. Come back home with the chickens. All the cheeky chickens. Lovesies. Hey there, girls. Scruffy looking girls. Mm -hmm. Oh, the others are over there. What do you think? The Goldie friend, didn't he? Well, his mum's allergic to anything. No. Not that we know of. Vacated to the outside. Whoa. So we've got left out of our play equipment. Need to invest in some more now. Now we've got miles, haven't we? And actually, annoyingly, Graham ordered a new trampoline from Amazon. But they, um, they cancelled the order because I, I, he reckons, and they refunded him like within days, and he reckons it's probably because everyone's going crazy and buying trampolines and stuff and getting things delivered, and now everywhere seems to be out of stock for like 10 or 12 foot trampolines. So I don't think we're gonna be able to get one anytime soon. Hopefully, get what? Hopefully before, Chris, before Christmas, before summer. This little box, um, little toy bag thingy that he's got in his room are full of all the toys that we don't play with that often I like kind of rotate them so he's playing with things that he doesn't he hasn't seen in ages which is quite nice isn't it it's nice to have changed different things to play with yeah because I get so bored of the same toys don't you have you got a drink I had a drink are you sure yeah first time we've all been in together Graham's back down the farm though, he will be back in a minute. Just after three, I've just put Miles down again. He's been up for just over two hours. I'm hoping he's gonna have like a little mini power nap just to get him by before bedtime. But I'm not sure, he's kind of on and off. You can hear the odd grizzle, so he might do. I'm just having a little afternoon pick me up. I'm so tired, you know when it just suddenly hits you, all the fresh air. Just been busy this morning and now I'm just like. He's awake. Oh, just turned off. <gasps> Hi. Someone had 40 minutes. Hey. Hi there, baby. Did you have a good nap? Hey. Yeah, it's four o'clock now. Daddy's just, I think he's testing out the little grill that we're using for the barbecue. We've only got sausages to go on it. It's just going to be like a mini thing, but it's going to be, obviously it's a nice day. So I was like, it'd be nice just to have a little barbie. Um, even, <laughs> oh, Half of our seat cushions were ruined. You know, we had that crazy like wind through winter. It was, yeah, we lost loads of cushions. They just got completely caught up in the barbed wire. Um, anyway, one thing I have done this week, last, yeah, this week, is I painted Alistair's door. Very happy with that. And now my next project, obviously, is to do Miles's door because yeah but I, one thing I have done as well because you know when you start painting everything white and then you notice everything looks yellow so I ended up doing a lot of the door frames and one other thing that I want to do this week is I brought in the paint to touch up the walls because there's like the odd marks you know what kids are like they kind of bash around and hand prints and all sorts so we've got a few um, walls that are slightly kind of marked yeah just refresh refresh when I get the time when he's hey. napping usually what's me and Violet doing what are we gonna do hot tab, time. Hot tab. I said to um I said to Violet ask Alistair if he wants to get in the hot tub he doesn't want to get in the hot tub so I was like how oh, is he he's on his bike he's just he loves just being outside and doing his own thing um yeah, so Graham's obviously sorting the barbecue out and I said, and Graham was like, why don't you get in the hot tub? And I was like, yes, okay, but he's got to look after the baby. Yeah. We only stay about in there about 20 minutes, but it'd be nice to, yeah, just get in there. It's been a couple of days. <laughs> So 
our little grill, just cooking some chipolatas. Actually, not done too bad, really. Graham thought it wasn't going to do much of a good job, but actually, they're cooking all right. Pour myself a little small glass of rose. Graham's slaving, slaving away. <gasps> little Munchie, what are you doing? No, you can't. He loves the look of that. But yeah, they look amazing, magical. We've got some potatoes. I'm going to do a potato salad got some onions and some boiled eggs so windy out there I think we'll probably end up having an indoor barbecue um, because most of it we've cooked inside anyway got my comfies on it's just a bit too windy out there yeah he's talking to my wine but yeah I'm talking to my wine yeah <laughs> Actually, which is all you know happy and awake it's five past six um, managed to get my Dyson going again so Graham ordered a battery oh, from Amazon only to find out that it's actually the charger that's kind of temperamental so we've ordered a charger now so we've got a new battery which is what we probably needed anyway um, but yeah now we're on to a char new charger. It's really temperamental. When you plug it in, it just kind of, it just doesn't work. Um, so yeah, waiting on that. But luckily, quite surprising how often I use the Dyson like every day. Just like whiz round. When you haven't got it, I was like sweeping up. And it was just taking forever. Dog hair was everywhere. Oh, it is a bit of a lifesaver having one. I'm not going to lie. Anyway, at least that's nice and clean. I feel like all the sides are really cluttered at the moment though. Stuff everywhere. Oh, wow. That's it, keep going. Oh, trying to get it up. Yes, keep going. Oh, yes, Miles. Oh, he nearly did it. Oh, did you see his face? He nearly did it, Gray. Higher. Yes, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Is it Miles? Keep going. Go, go, go. Is it bring that left hand up? He's like, what are you all about? Oh. Did I scare you? Sorry. It's concentration. <laughs> Go on, Ed, Keep going. Bring it up. Bring it up. Look, Greg, can you see? Oh, oh, so close. So close. So close. That's it. <laughs> he just wants it in his mouth. Yay, he did it. Oh, <laughs> he knocked them all back down. Mmm, yummy. Right, baby's in bed. We've got pudding. Yum. And we are watching Jumanji, the new Jumanji. We just downloaded it on Sky. Right, off to bed we go. We watched Jumanji. What do you think of Jumanji, Vi? It was so hot. See, it's quite warm. Jumanji 2, did you like it? It's a good one. We're off to bed, it's 9 o'clock. Tired, we had a long day, enjoying the sunshine. He's gone. Anyway, I'm sure I will catch you over the Easter half ten. Have a good one, enjoy the weather. 20 degrees next week. So looking forward to that.
Um, just need to get the garden sorted though. It's one of those things that you just, it kind of creeps up on you. The weather suddenly just turns really good and your gardens, our gardens, an absolute mess. It's going to take time. <coughs> um, but yeah, stay safe. I hope you're well and I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching.